Hi guys, Martin Dragnev with the group Real Estate up in Steamboat. Uh, beautiful sunny bluebird day up here. I am at 2675 Ski Trail Lane. This is really a unique street, really the only street giving um, um, a single family home, ski in, ski out type of, a, or close to. A ski in, ski out would be the properties on this side of the road. Um, the, the, so the gentleman is interested in selling this property, is not listed yet. They did build the home next door and they're hoping to move in there in the next couple of months. This home was built, I believe, around 1980, but it has been remodeled. Uh, you may want to put more finishing touches on it. Uh, here is the home. Uh, amazing views. That's really the, the part that um, defines this property. And, and this street is a very exclusive street where property values stay very strong. Um, the duplex right at the end of the shot currently, just half a duplex sold for 5.5 uh, .5 million recently. Um, and you have a lot of upscale properties here. There's no really cap on values here. Um, Two-car garage. The apron is heated. The pavers are heated. You do have a two-car garage and you do go down a set of stairs to the entrance of the home. I'll try to give you a good idea of everything. Definitely feels like a ski chalet. Very, very cute. I, I love that they gave me a little tour before they let me shoot it. Have a little treks landing here. Or you can put a sitting area in the summer. The railings were recently redone and the trek decking boards were redone. Very private entrance here. There's another entrance to the home from the bottom level, but we're just going to stick with the main entrance for now. They've done an extensive remodel here. There are still some, like this tile entry here, um, that are left from the old home, but not many. Coat closet. We have a bedroom up, a master to the left. And uh, we will start here on the main level. They do have a full bath. Ooh, light was on. Which has been remodeled. Here is the kitchen area. Uh, there's two living areas. Well, they've converted this into a dining area up here. Um, um, so there's another living area on the bottom level. One thing about the home is there are um, on a smaller side of things. My favorite part besides location is the view that they have. <clears throat> From Sleeping Giant, just sweeping views, Emerald. Between the two homes, the one they're building and this one, they own pretty much all this land down below. So nothing would be built. Back to the view, you can see all the way down to the flat tops, stagecoach, South Valley. There is a there is a lot on the ridge line on the other side of that tree line. Otherwise, this is like a drainage easement. So this will stay with a ton of elbow room forever. This is Trex decking. I can see this being very nice in the summer.
So this is the entry door I came in. This is the master. King size bed. The home is built, like I said, right around 1980. Um, they've done a remodel. I forgot what year they said they did the remodel. He did tile in here. Another bedroom up these steps. They've set it with two beds. Amazing views from it. Looks like the home has a very interesting kind of a ski chalet character. I'm not sure if this, uh, this might be more of a yeah, you would need to put additional funds and maybe make it a little more your own. Um, so we already filmed this level. Here is bedroom number three. Very good separation between the bedrooms. And privacy, they've put naughty older... Um, trim and doors this is that second entrance that i mentioned this is the oversized laundry room boot storage folding table it's like a bench with cubbies have a lot of closets. I'm not opening every closet. Another full bathroom here. This is the main living area. Bedroom number four. With a king size bed. One thing I forgot to mention, the reason they have this extra entrance there is back in the 70s or 80s, this was originally a up and down duplex. So they have that's why they have the two kitchen areas. A hot tub here, which will stay. Definitely on a smaller side of things for a living room. This is a, a nice kitchen wet bar setup um, one idea would be if you needed to make this living room bigger maybe that can be torn out and converted into sitting areas and lastly this deck very good size Uh, with a bench hot tub this is all covered here and really uh, there are awesome views again from down here I hope this helps I can probably clarify things better over the phone or answer questions better over the phone um, I'm sure I'll talk to you guys soon thank you so much